They come to Canada for a better life, but the children of immigrants may pay a price with their health. The Clark family emigrated from India. Their son Rashid discovered in his early 20s he had ulcerative colitis. Until I came along, no one else in my family had inflammatory bowel disease. The symptoms, painful bloody diarrhea so severe, he had surgery to remove the diseased colon. My quality of life is better now than it was when I had an active disease, but it's not as good as when I didn't have the disease at all. Inflammatory bowel disease, which includes Crohn's and colitis, is rising rapidly in North America and Europe, yet there's little of it in Asia, Africa and South America. Now a study confirms the younger a child when they emigrate to Canada, the higher the risk they will get this disease. Something in the Canadian environment increases your risk of developing inflammatory bowel disease. The leading culprits, low vitamin D levels from our long dark winters, extreme cleanliness that limits children's exposure to bacteria, and food additives that affect bacteria in our gut that normalize our immune system. What we really like to find is a way to predict which individuals are going to develop this and give some preventive therapy at a very young age, perhaps even in infancy. Rashid knows other children of immigrants with the same disorders. It's vitally important that we figure out exactly what's behind the diseases. Raising the question, why does geography have such a powerful and devastating effect? Avis Favreau, CTV News, Toronto.